Did you know that you have a messaging option in Moodle where you can decide how you want messages and other course updates and notifications sent to you? This is a new feature in Moodle 2.0 and I wanted to show everyone how to do it. As you can see, I'm logged into the home page of our EdTech Moodle site and you'll see under your settings, My Profile Settings. Go ahead and click to expand that and select Messaging. You will see a table with four different options for receiving different types of alert and alerts and messages. So, for instance, assignment notifications. You may decide you want those as an alert badge. This is your alert badge over here. If you have notifications, a number will show up and you can click it and you'll be able to view all of your notifications. You may decide you don't want to receive any alerts of assignment notifications or you might want to have them go to your email. So this is where you would select that. Each person has different options depending upon the permissions that you have in Moodle. So some of these things you won't see. But for instance, your course grade changed. Maybe you just want an alert badge when an assignment has been graded and your course grade has been changed. Or maybe you don't want anything and you just want to click your grades and look at it that way. Your instructor may have some glossary entries that you may want to see updated or an essay. Personal messages between users is really helpful to have this set how you want. That's the internal messaging system in Moodle. What I like to do is when I'm logged in, I like to have them just pop up and they'll, they'll actually be a pop-up notification on your screen. When I'm offline, I like to just have it go to my alert badge. That way, when I come back to the course, I'll see that I have a message and I can send you a message directly from Moodle instead of having it come to my email, an extra step, and then emailing you back. But this is entirely your choice. When an activity has been upgraded or updated or added, you might want to be notified of that. However, if you're one of my students and I'm constantly kind of adding new information to be more helpful on weekly activities, you may not want to receive these updates. They may be too many of them. When you've completed an activity, if your instructor has enabled course completion, you might want to get a notification of that. Or when an activity has been graded, if you've subscribed to certain forum posts, you may want to be notified when a new forum post has been posted. When you're online, you maybe you want to have it go to your alert badge. And then feedback notifications. These are feedback that your instructor has given you on assignments. You can temporarily disable notifications, but I would probably recommend not doing that. And you can also change where you want to send your email notifications to if you've selected email in any of these activities or notifications. By default, it will select the email in your Moodle profile, but you can always add another email here. And then make sure you select Update Profile. This is a really important part of it. Otherwise, Moodle won't know how you want to customize your settings. So again, when you log into our Moodle site, you can select My Profile Settings to expand the options, and you can select Messaging and then go through each of the items and decide how you want to receive message updates and other activity updates. I hope this helps a lot and thank you so much for viewing.